rules for a good clean fight when the bell rings, come out fighting. All right, starting off round one. Both of them a little uncertain on the glove touch, but. Yeah, I mean, that happens, especially your first fight. Like, uh, oh, oh, right away with big, heavy letter from both guys. Hector out of the red corner. Oliver out of the blue. Oliver, from what Coming we've from seen, too. Oliver does have knockdown power, so for a little guy, he throws hard, hard shots. You see both of them. Here. And he's drooling. Oh, big, 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 big shot there. Ah. He's taking groin, uh, you know. You need, you got to take that time to recover. It's totally fine. I'm not sure if it was a knee or a kick. Doesn't matter. I think it was a knee. But yeah, Oliver was really picking up momentum at that point. Um. And I think I think Hector just basically raised his leg up to check a kick, and it was just in the range. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna start the action again. And this is mouthpiece. I guess his mouthpiece his fell out in that exchange. Um, no, I don't think he started the round with his mouthpiece. Oh my then. God! Okay. <laughs> oh man, Ooh. a big left hand solid. lands. Hector, solid hook. Hector recovers from that one, goes into the clinch, overhand right landed there by Hector. Oliver looking for a head kick. Hector doing a good job of, of covering and countering. Big body kick lands there by Hector as well. And Hector is cut over the right eye. Ah, another groin shot. Yeah, Hector that's, has a uh, cut there. You can see him leaking uh, over his left be eye. A fight right there. You know, you know, ref's going to give him a warning, let him know. You know, again, th these guys. This is uh, Oliver's third fight and Hector's second fight. So you get a little amped, you get a little, you get a little crazy. You, you start flurrying, and your accuracy kind of goes out the window and. You know, accidents like this do happen. He was landing that big left, and then it was like a 3-2. Oliver could take a Oh, punch. another 3-2. And Hector just kind of swarming here. Ducks under, comes back with another 3-2. And so coming out of Remy Elite, you know, they, they really pride themselves on their boxing as well there. Putting their Absolutely. punches together really well. Rami did time as a professional boxer. He yeah, knows he, the value of it. He, uh, I think he won the Golden Gloves maybe two or three times. But then also, I mean, Jason Strout, another great boxing coach. Oh, great boxing coach. You know, puts together his combinations well. Teaches you the level of aggressivity that you need. Nice knee that ends that round there for uh, Oliver. And we're starting oh, round two of this junior lightweight battle between Hector and Oliver. Now you can see that Oliver is adjusted to the first round and is trying to come out a little bit heavier with his hands. Nice one-two combination ending with a low kick. Also trying to set up the clinch too. Yeah, just trying to, to stop the, uh, the, the hands of Hector who really just loves to use his boxing here. Here he clinches up. Oh, big uppercut lands big through uppercut. the middle of the clinch. And you see Oliver, you know, trying to look for a crossblock, but he doesn't really have it. You want to also make sure that you're, if you do grab, you grab behind the elbow so it's a little bit harder to get away. Looking for a crossblock here, lands a knee. Hector again using his hands. Oliver trying to go through Hector's guard, keeping him in the corner there. Hector pivoting out of the corner, coming back with a nice big one-two. Looking for that body shot. Oliver shells up and then counters and returns with this clinch. Trying this to keep Hector in that corner. Everything in there. Another knee. 
Uppercut lands by Hector. Hector answers back with a knee of his own. Yeah, H uh, Hector is now pushing Oliver into the corner. Hector with a knee. Looks like Oliver's losing, losing a little bit of steam here, looking for body shots. Hector covers up. A nice teep that lands, pushes Hector back. They're both throwing everything. Punches are starting to get a little bit mushy, but they're just digging into the body. You see what Oliver is shelling up, then goes for the clinch here, is controlling Oliver the head. To his Hector catches Oliver on one foot and dumps him to the canvas. And that ends the second round. Yeah, they're really looking to like rack up the points with the body shots on the. With, with oh, the big overhand oh. that lands there by Hector. As you can see, Hector is not. He doesn't want to leave this in the hands of the judges. He's trying to show his dominance here in the third round. Nice teep pushes Hector, pushes Oliver back. Hector again, just looking to kind of keep Oliver in a corner and just dominate him using his He's punches. Just bullying him into the corner. It's a matter of wind at this point, though. Well, you can see Oliver's strategy here is to clinch up and use his knees and just tenderize the body and slow Hector down. And the second they get out in the open mat, it's a whole different story. Like well, one thing that you know Oliver really has to do is if he's going to come in, he's got to come in with something because when he walks in, that gives Hector an opportunity to set something up or to throw something. You know, oh, big oh. spinning back fist there. Oliver again looking for those knees. Punches landing they, through the guard. Oh, a big God. right hand that lands. Just a slug fest. I mean, you got to see both guys really want it. Neither one of them have kind of backed down from each other. They're, they're both continuing to push. Right oh. now, you've got to see that but we see that Oliver slumped over. He was trying to claim get shots of the nuts, but I don't think the... the no, no, I, it, it looked like exhaustion. Yep. He gets a standing he eight. Count. He's got to come back, and that could decide the fight for Hector right uh, there. Of course, that's as I'm saying that he keeps fighting, that he yeah. stops over, but... <laughs> as you can see, you know, he's still very much in it now. Oh, and Hector, just big shots. Big right hand that lands. Last 10 seconds. Oliver's trying to shell up, but just... Hector just... Continuously coming forward. Woo! And that ends the third and final round. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the okay, judges' yeah. score totals. Judge A scores this bout 28-28 even. Wow. Oh, wow. Judge B scores the bout 30 to 26, and Judge C scores the bout 29 to 27. Both for your winner by majority decision. Hector Franco. I mean, it's understandable that there, there would be somebody who saw it as a draw because yeah, they geez. really did have a back and forth. Um, yeah. And the second round, debatably, you can say was Oliver's round because yeah. of his dominance in the clinch for that round.